In a Renaissance villa on the outskirts of Venice, bachelor Gavin Henson is hosting a masked ball as he continues the search for his dream woman. Helping him are two close friends, Matt and Niels. Based on what they gleaned from their conversations with the girls earlier, they've chosen just three partners for Gavin to dance and spend time with this evening. And their first choice is about to be revealed. Gavin, it's April. Oh, cheers, Matt. As Venetian tradition dictates, the bachelor invites April to dance by presenting her with a lace handkerchief. April, will you dance for me, please? Yes. Oh, and then. Thank God. Should I have the waltz at all, no? You can teach I'll go me. under there, so you rest your arm on there, yeah? Okay. I'm so happy they picked you anyway. So. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, oh. Right. Need more balance tonight. Right, pain in the arms. <laughs> yeah. So it's kind of like that, so they're the basic steps. After their dances, the three chosen girls will each get some private time with the bachelor. So Gavin leads April to a quiet corner. It's their first chance to spend time alone since Gavin awarded her a rose at the burlesque date in Saint Tropez. I love your stubble. I like it. Do you like the stubble? No, yeah. I do, yeah. Jenny? Yeah. Have you been single for a while then? Or yeah, I told your friend. I've been single for like two and a half years. Single for two and a half mm. years? Yeah, I've dated people in between. Yeah, like, yeah. But just like. But I, I feel like I don't want to yeah, waste yeah. their time, I don't want to waste my time if yeah. I haven't met the right person yet. Yeah, it's exactly the same for me, and, and because I don't really let people in. Yeah, I'm exactly the it's same, like, yeah. yeah. It's a difficult, it's really difficult. It really is. Gavin's friends have picked the three girls they feel would make the best match for The Bachelor, and their choice hasn't gone down well with everyone else. Well, obviously, we didn't say to impress them. Do you know what Layla said? Layla was like... Lady was like, I can't sit here and watch this, it makes me feel so sick. And she was like, oh. It's time for some more hanky panky as the bachelor's next dance partner is revealed. Oh, how was it, buddy? Right. Uh, you're going to go to uh, Layla. Oh, good choice. Yeah, okay, my friend. Thank you very much. Enjoy. Oh, excuse me, sir. Could I dance with Layla, please? Are you taking me away? Yes, please, sir. Ready for a waltz? I'm awful, Gavin. Please You're awful, please yeah? Don't right, hold on in. While Cinderella is trampling all over her prince's feet, and then I go down. Yeah. Morgan and Carrie Ann are looking more like the ugly sisters. Can you believe that Layla got it again? Like, what the fuck? I told you she was lying when she said there was no chemistry. Like, she's like the one person that I dreaded getting it. Hey, I was sweating a bit then, actually. Layla was the most recent girl to date The Bachelor when she and Gavin sailed off on a day trip to Saint-Tropez. And how do, you, how do you feel about things since I last seen you? I just feel like really like relaxed just talking, you know, so it's Yeah, it feels that way, doesn't it? But yeah. You were obviously worried about the friendship thing. Yeah, I just thought that you might that look level. at me like a, <laughs> a mate. I don't feel that, but do you feel that way then or not? No. Yeah, I don't. Okay. I'm confident. <laughs> Me and Layla got an obvious connection. It's definitely a romantic spark between us. You know, we, we kind of haven't had a chance to build on that yet, but I'm sure we will. Gavin's trusted conciliaries can award only one more dance. Uh, I think you should dance with Shavila. Ooh, Shavila, is it? You liked her, did you? Yeah. Oh. 21-year-old Shavile has had very little time alone with Gavin since she won his rose on their very first date together the swimwear photo shoot. Shavile, can I take this dance, please? Yes. 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 Can you waltz? Yes. It's just annoying, isn't it? Yeah. Like we have to get to know him, and we're getting hardly any time with him. Like, it's so annoying. You're a really good dancer. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Oh, very good. Best one so far? Obviously, the, them three are their favourites. I'm really glad that your friends, your mates, chose me. Definitely the best dancer tonight, so I enjoyed really? it. Really? Mm. Oh, I'm happy to hear that, thank you. No I, I felt your strong body and I just uh, follow you. <laughs> good work. When you told that we're going to have a mask ball, I was just so excited. I will enjoy it. It's kind of a fairy tale. Yeah, that's been a great night then. Yeah. And to get mm. the, a little bit of time with the friends is also very good. <laughs>
Shavile has always been the one that I'm so intrigued by. And every time I speak to her, <laughs> I'm always kind of left, oh, I just, I need to know more. Traditionally, the masked ball is a place of secrets, intrigue, rumour and scandal. Now Morgan has the ear of Gavin's friend Matt and she has something she wants to get off her chest. There is definitely some people in here that are not in it for the right the reasons. reasons at all. I'm not going to tell you what happened because it's really bad on Carrie and she's like my best friend in here. But what, what did she do? Did she but pull? Not, in, not really, but... <laughs> Self. I can't. She's I hope you're not playing me there on that. No, I don't. I won't say anything. Please don't say anything. Whatever Carrie Ann may or may not have done remains a secret. For now. <laughs> 